Welcome to Spider Technologies. My name is Jason, and today I would like to give you a quick demonstration of the Spider PBX telephone system and how it integrates with Content Management Systems, or CMS. Now, the first thing you may be wondering is, what exactly is a CMS package, and why would I want to integrate with it in the first place? Well, a CMS package is basically software that allows you to easily create and manage content for a website without any technical expertise at all. This means you do not need to be a web developer to build a website. And we support two very popular packages, WordPress and Joomla, installed directly on your Spider PBX. In fact, WordPress alone supports about 40% of all websites on the entire internet today. Okay, so a website that is easy for anyone to build, that's great, but then why would you want to integrate a website with your telephones? Well, an important distinction uh, to help you understand first is that this website will not be on the public internet. Instead, this would traditionally be referred to as building an intranet. That is, a website designed to help your own people internal to your business. It will contain sensitive information that never leaves your building. Now, if you want people to remotely access this information, say if they're a telecommuter working from home, then you would typically give them that access but still maintain security through a VPN. Okay, so an internal website that is easy to build and just for employees, tell me more. Well, an easy example would be for an answering service that is perhaps covering for other doctor's offices after hours. Their agents will need certain information to answer those calls. The next distinction I would like to make here is that you do not necessarily care who is calling, but rather who is being called. That means the pop-ups you get with CMS integration is based on the telephone number that was dialed and not the caller ID of the inbound caller themselves. So let's make a test call and see what this actually looks like. Here we go. Okay. Now, here we have a pop-up to help me answer the calls for my client, in this case, ABC Company, that has forwarded their lines to my answering service. This page tells me what I need to say with their specific greeting, and I can further use the information I see here to answer any general questions a caller may have for ABC Company, my client. Scrolling down, I can see their hours of operations, directions to their location, some general product information, and some contact numbers. This is just one easy example I can give you to showcase CMS integration with your Spider PBX telephone system. But this is not just for answering services. You can also use this for onboarding new employees or cross-training them to work across multiple departments at the same time. Maybe your corporate office runs a call center for all of your many locations, and those agents need information based upon the specific location that was called. It can be used for any shared resource, such as a knowledge base or an employee portal, complete with a click-to-dial directory. Anything that will improve the way you communicate within your own organization. Okay, so you have an internal website just for employees that automatically pops open specific information depending on the type of call that's coming in right now. So now let's see how easy it will be for you to get that information in there. To do this, I'm going to log in. And we can see the dashboard and we're going to modify the information for ABC company you can see everything is laid out in a simple text editor 
and we're going to add another holiday, Thanksgiving. And I'm going to spell it correctly. We're going to update the information and view the post just to make sure that it took properly. And here we are. So now let me put this all together and take you to the welcome page, which brings it all together. Scroll down. And there are four basic steps. Step one, you have an outside caller uh, that calls your client ABC company in this case. Step two, your client ABC company has forwarded their phone lines to your answering service with a telephone number assigned to only this client. The third step is that the spider will accept the call and automatically prefix their caller ID, typically with the last four digits of the telephone number used for this client. The final step is that the outside caller will be routed to your agent who is going to get a pop-up and see the information for your client, in this case, ABC Company, based on that uh, code prefix that we saw, 4567. And I hope this gives you a nice little demonstration on the integration the Spider PBX has with content management systems and how having an internal website can be used to improve the way you communicate within your own organization and ultimately help your people with the customers you serve. The Spider PBX really is quite capable, so please let us know if you'd like to help you out and give us a contact. Thank you. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, and click the bell icon for notifications of new videos. Thank you from all of us at Spider Technologies.